spoilers if you care, I guess. So, after having its theatrical release cancelled, Scoob was finally released on digital platforms, and it's not good. No, seriously, it's not good. It's really, it's, it's really bad. First of all, there are a lot of tropes that are really common in these types of uh, bad kids movies, like a dance party ending, a fake out death from one of the main characters, a huge argument in the third act, a character splitting up with his group of friends, like, for some godforsaken reason, Simon Cole is in this movie? He, he's really out of place. That's a, that's another thing this movie suffers from, is that there's just random celebrities shoved into the movie for no reason other than for marketing. These voices do not fit these characters. They were clearly shoving these celebrities in just so they could get their names on the posters, and that's that. And it did not work out well, because nobody sounds natural. Everybody just sounds like... Celebrities doing crappy impressions just so they could get the job done and nothing else. There are a lot of really unnecessary pop songs and referential humor for some reason. There's like a there's like a really out of place joke about Netflix and IKEA, which were already in the trailers, but it's just way more in here because there's there's like a Walmart joke for some reason. Second of all, the movie's really not well put together because there are some scenes that just drag on for way too long. The writing really was not all that good. The, a lot of the jokes fell flat. Uh, the, the pacing especially is not good. The movie also completely loses its shit in I'd say the last half of it. There's a really weird subplot about how Muttley from Wacky Races actually went to hell to go grab treasure, and he's stuck in hell, and now Dick Dastardly, ha, is trying to, like, get him back. Like, what? This is a Scooby-Doo movie. I don't want this in my Scooby-Doo movie. Just, ah. Uh, this movie's not fun to watch at all. I do not recommend it. Um... Though, there are some positives. I honestly thought the movie looks pretty good for the most part. There is some weirdly stiff animation, and some of the character designs are uh, pretty pretty bad, but uh, the a lot of the animation was fluid. There are some kind of cool nods to the original Scooby-Doo series and some other Hanna-Barbera properties. Uh, the music's also pretty good as well. It was done by Tom Holkenberg, who also did the music for... Uh, Deadpool, Elite Battle Angel, the Sonic movie, and those are all pretty kick-ass soundtracks, so I don't, I'm not complaining. But, uh, yeah, it's not a good movie. It's completely unfocused, uh, it's not funny, it's not enjoyable, it's just, it's just... It's not a Scooby-Doo movie, for the most part. It's mostly just a generic, bad kids movie. And that's really a shame, because I was looking forward to this movie. I was actually planning on going to see this in theaters before COVID happened and shut this movie down and forced it to go onto digital platforms. I was genuinely excited because I thought this had potential. But now I'm really not looking forward to this whole Hanna-Barbera cinematic universe that for some reason Warner Brothers is planning out. But... Yeah, this movie's this movie sucks. Like, three out of ten. I don't like it. Don't watch it. Maybe like, maybe like watch it if it comes like to HBO Max or Netflix or whatever. Uh, yeah, don't 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 pay for this movie. So yeah, I'm trying out a new format for these types of videos. I want to try doing more consistent uh, uploads. So I decided the best way to do that is make quicker less meme videos than I usually do, and I think this is a good way to sort of scratch that itch I've had for making reviews while also not having to sink in all the time it takes to make a fully-fledged big review. I hope you guys enjoy this new formula and I'm hoping to make more of these types of videos in the future. Uh, tell me what you guys think of this formula in the comments below, uh, make sure to like and subscribe, follow me on Twitter, check out my Discord if you want, but uh, bye for now.